Okay, we got an update. Uh, the refrigerator is working. Uh, the handles are on already. Uh, after the compressor and everything has been installed, it's uh, blowing cold air here and here. Let me show you the temperature. Let me just shut this off. Okay, we read a freezing temperature of zero degrees Fahrenheit. Plus, we got some ice built up here. It's pretty cold. I just turned it on this morning to test again. So, zero degrees Fahrenheit. The conventional conventional compressor is working on this digital freezer I'm sorry refrigerator so I'll keep you posted once I rewire because right now I got it uh, hardwired this uh, uh, wire is for the compressor alone and this is for the board I'm still running the board with the original uh, cable but uh, I'll be rewiring to run on only one cable and put a, a wire, the thermostat and everything. I'll keep you posted. Hi, I'm doing an update on the refrigerator conversion. I just took out the board here and I've been looking at the wiring. So I've been getting all the, from the one on the compressor that's a compressor this one is a neutral i got my lights defrost i got my fans in here which i haven't hooked this is positive that's a negative okay well the thing is that i just uh, remove the board and I'm running the refrigerator for the first time. This is a neutral that's a positive. The positive from the from the compressor. This one is going for through the thermostat, which is here. I'm gonna use this one because the other one doesn't fit quite well. It's the same thing. This one is working. Okay, so that's gonna be hooked, but right now I'm uh, hardwiring the refrigerator as of now, which I've gotten. I got a light for the freezer hooked already. That's the switch from the door. The light is uh, this one right here. Line for 120 for the bulb inside the freezer. Okay. So that's as far as the wiring. I'm still working on it. And let's see the compressor. That's a conventional compressor. It is. It's been uh, wired with a refrigerator. Those uh, three poles coming. The red one being the neutral, the green, the earth ground, and that's the start capacitor for the conventional compressor. That. Uh, is being split here one is going to neutral for the this one is the start and uh, this one that's a common and the gray one I'm sorry is the start this is a neutral okay so the overload protector is in place the PCB is in place too I got my capacitor going that's the power I will see how it goes once I turn it on Beautiful. The refrigerant is flowing as the return for, to, for the capillary. Let me focus here. Okay, my capillary. My line, this is my high side, is hot. Gets really hot. My cold side is cold. Right now the 
condenser fine is not working because it's not hooked up yet it's a 16 volt in here so I'm going to get a this one here is 16 volts okay anyway right now I got my compressor going and uh, that's it it's a uh, hot my high side my low side is right now cold it's getting colder let me show you the inside of the freezer I just hooked the, the light bulb in here look at the light I'm gonna turn off as soon as I hit the switch look at that and then once it co flows colder from the fans there's three fans one two on the side and uh, one for the refrigerator okay so right now this is working I'll keep you posted and once I complete or continue to the next step right now it's beautifully working the refrigerator com conversion and running without the board the board is here it's gonna be sold for parts or, sc or scrap so we got the conversion of board compressor going it's getting cold I'm gonna turn it off because my condenser is not uh, or the fans are not uh, running okay Thanks, please like. Hello, and this is the final update for the fridge. Now it's fully working. It's making ice, nice and cold. The lights are working too. I had to put that LED. It's full of food right now. We've got a uh, Fridge temperature one to three degrees Celsius. Let me show you. This is my thermostat in the fridge. It was hot uh, wired to the ice maker. It was bolted in, and it's working perfectly. That's the first thermostat right there. The light is working. Was just placed in in place of the other light. And now the temperature is working, is uh, going up because it's open. But it's nice and cold and everything. We had some cactuses they were, they were given to us for free. Okay, let's let's go check out the none of these work. Because the board is out, so there's no water or ice, but everything inside is working. Let me show you the fridge without any board. Okay, now I need to cut out any remaining cables. This is a laptop charger that is 16 volt out, in, hot, in. This one, the pink, is going from the thermostat. So it turns on the compressor and the fans. That one's going here for 16 volts. This is this two? Those power all the fans inside. The condenser. The there's three evaporators. One down in the freezer. Two, one on the side that goes around all the way to the top, and one here in the back. And uh, that's for my light. That's a 12 volt transformer for my light. I just opened the the laptop charger and glued it in back to the, this space and now this one powers my light is 12 volts that's the switch that whenever you open the door uh, it powers on sends power to the LED bulb and that's it that's my compressor it's a conventional it's not an inverter as it's, it's capacitor 
this hot wire is electrical tape. Everything's working. The fan is working. Has been welded. This compressor came out from an older fridge, which is conventional. Was refilled. Has a new filter dryer. Everything's working. It's been working fine for a couple of days. I'm gonna test it for at least uh, two weeks, huh? a month, to see how the defrost timer is working. Uh, hot wire or word up the 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 defrost heater they had. So apparently it's working. It hasn't been the temperature hasn't fluctuated much. It's been working good. So. Please thumbs up. This is a conversion fridge from digital to com to conventional. It was a board fridge. It has no board. It has a hot wire to a conventional regular fridge. Please like. Don't help me. Don't help me a lot. Thank you very much.